going to be going over the installation of a Generac transfer switch. Get the front panel off. We'll go ahead and take this off. All right. There's the guts of it. We'll do our high voltage connection coming from the meter. The bottom connection will be going to our breaker panel and this connection right here will be going to our generator and then these are our control wires for our generator. So we're going to start by getting mounted on the wall up next to the meter base. We'll mount it right here. Alright, before I get this thing mounted I'm going to go ahead and connect these with a two inch piece of PVC so I'm going to put me a two inch hole in the side of my box here and a two inch hole in the side of my meter base here in order to connect the two. I'm going to do that using a drill with a unibit and I've got a knockout punch set that goes up to two inch that I'll use to put that in there. So I'll go ahead and get those put in get the male adapters put in and get this thing mounted on the wall. All right, we got the hole in it now. Now we're gonna go ahead and get our two inch male adapter on here and on the meter base. All right, we got the male adapters in to the transfer switch and into the meter base. I went ahead and glued in my stub piece where they're gonna connect as well. So we're gonna go ahead and get this transfer switch mounted up right here, glued into the side and screwed onto the wall and then we'll set our generator and then uh, we'll start wiring this thing up to the, the meter All base. right, we got the transfer switch mounted. We got it connected with the PVC and we got our handy dandy level out here. Make sure it's nice, sitting nice and pretty there. So now we're going to go ahead and run some wires. Uh, I am probably going to go ahead and kill the power to the whole house here in just a minute in order to disconnect these two wires and get everything connected the way it needs to be. Uh, so after I run the wire, I'll turn back on the video and show you exactly which wires went to where and why. All right, we got the wires wired in for the high voltage. We just ran the whip for the generator here, and I still haven't turned the power off to connect these wires yet, but uh, I went ahead and did the hole in here, ran some inch and a quarter seal tight, liquid tight, down to the generator. I'm going to go ahead and wire this up as well as the control wiring. I ran in two different circuits to go up to the ground and the transfer wire in one and two and T1. So I'll go ahead and do that now, get this all wired up in here, and then I'm going to get it all wired up in here, and then I'll show you what it all looks like and why. All right, I got it all wired up. These two top ones, these two top wires, they go to the bottom of the meter base. Now this meter base has a breaker on it here, so I'll uh, but that's where they go. If it was a regular meter base, it'd just be right on the bottom lugs. So those go to the top. The power comes into the top of the transfer switch. And normally it'll just go out on the bottom on those back two wires, T1 and T2. And those two wires are tied into these that go into the panel. These are Polaris fittings that I use to splice that two out wire together. Then the generator wire comes from the control in the generator here, rounds up the seal tight here, and goes on to E1 and E2. And that's what supplies the power for the house whenever you uh, have an outage. So right now this switch is in the up position here. That's just the normal position for utility power to flow through this. Whenever the uh, power in the generator is running, that's a pretty hard flip there. It'll be in this position here and the power will just go right through E1 and E2. Put that back up. So I'm going to go ahead and get the covers back on and put all this back together all nice and neat. And then we're going to start this generator up and test it out. But that is the wiring on how to install one of these transfer switches for a Generac generator. The premise is the same for most generator brands though. All right.